My brother, my sister, in life, many people are going to discourage you. But don't listen to them. Don't give them attention. They just want you to give up on God. When people start saying that you can never get married, no man will ever marry you. You can never conceive. You can never get pregnant. You can never have your own child. Don't fight them. They are not your enemies. The reason why they are speaking about your personal life, it's not their personal life, but it's your personal life. The reason why they are speaking about this is because they have seen that there is a great blessing coming on your way. That is the reason why they are speaking against you. They want you to give up on God, but never give up because of what they are saying. Don't let anyone discourage you. You belong to God and you belong to God alone. When they see your blessing or when they see that something great is pending in your life, they start speaking against you. Don't give them attention. Those who are telling you that you can never give birth, you can never have your own child, you can never get married or no man will ever marry you. Don't give them attention. They have seen your glory. They have seen your grace. They have seen your victory. That is the reason why they are jealous and they are speaking against it. When people start speaking this way, it means that your blessings and your grace is pending. Never, never give them attention. Don't fight them. They are not your enemy. I promise you. If you trust and obey the Lord at the right time, all those who are speaking against you, they are going to serve your visitors on your wedding day. I said, they are going to serve your visitors whilst you are naming your daughter, your son, your twins, your triplets. They are your servant. They are not your enemies. They have seen your blessings. They have seen your grace. That is why they are speaking that way, that you can never give birth. You can never get married. I said, on your wedding day, the same people are going to serve your visitors on your wedding day. They are your servant. They are not your enemies. So always pray for them so that God will give them strength to serve you on your wedding day or whilst you are naming your son or your daughter or your twins. I pray for you today. May God bless you. May God guide you. May God answer all your prayers. You will never lack. You will never beg. You will be the head but not the tail. Never give up. Never let anyone discourage you. They want to discourage you so that you give up on God. Never give up on anything. The reason why they are speaking against your personal life is because they have seen your grace. They have seen that there is going to be a great blessing for you. That is the reason why they are speaking against you. Never let anyone discourage you. If you, if you are listening to them all the time, my brother my sister, you are going to give up on God. Such people are not your enemies. They are also part of your blessings. At the right time, they are going to serve you. They are your servant. They are going to serve your visitors on your wedding day. The same people who are disgracing you, who are saying bad things about you today, tomorrow, they are going to serve you. They are not your enemies, but they are, they are your servant. They will serve you at the right time. May God put your enemies to shame. Those who want to are down for, those who are laughing at you today, may they see your victory. Tomorrow by this time, God is going to turn your life around. And all these people who are laughing at you, they will see you. They will not disgrace you, but they will salute you. May God bless you. This is your one and everything, Mr. Jerry.